Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be showing you the best weapons to use in Fortnite Save the World to clear missions, to trade and to level up. Before this video does start, make sure to come to the item shop and click support creator and type in my code LTWORLD. It really does help me out as a creator and without further ado, let's get right into the video. So obviously the first thing I'm going to do is we're going to come to the Fortnite Battle Royale lobby and find Save the World. Click here and click select and click play. Alright, so now that we're in Fortnite Save the World, what we're going to do is come to the llama shop here and click on items now if you go down here occasionally you will see that these weapons here rotate depending on what the event is now last event we actually got the weapon called the plasmatic discharger which is one of the weapons i'm going to be showing you today also alongside this also includes the pot shot so let's head to our armory and come to schematics so as you can see here i've only got a few 130 schematics but only the ones i need now, not everyone will have these two weapons here, as these are mythic weapons from defeating the mythic Storm King, which I will be making a video on how to solo pretty soon, so make sure to stick around for that video. But the first weapon of this video I'm going to show you is the Plasmatic Discharger. Now, this weapon is probably the most overpowered weapon in Save the World. This weapon smashes through everything. So what I'm going to do is load into the highest power level mission that I can currently access, which will be this Fight Category 160. But for the sake of this video, I'm going to do the Retrieve the Data, because it's just a lot easier to complete. Complete. so we're going to come here and we're going to click select the reason why i'm going into a 160 mission instead of a low power mission is because you can actually see the true damage compared to the lower power level missions what use would it be if i showed you the damage in a power level 4 it just doesn't make sense so now that i'm loaded into the mission what i'm going to do is get my 130 plasmatic discharger out it also does obviously increase the damage if it's 144 but i believe it's only increasing by like five or ten percent correct me if i'm wrong all right so here are a few mobs not that many but there's a few here so what we're going to do is shoot our plasmatic as you can see here it shoots a ball of energy which absolutely tears through zombies and you can see as well these are actually power level 250 zombies this is probably the highest power level zombie you can get in normal save the world uh excluding frost knight obviously but as you can see here we just shoot it and it absolutely obliterates it Give me a second to find a smasher and I will show you how well it kills that as well. One eternity later. Okay, so as we found a smasher now, what we're going to do is just shoot right at the smasher. And it's going to completely avoid us. Alright, so now that we found a smasher, what we're going to do is just shoot it to... Bruh. Okay, so as you can see here, I found a smasher. So what I'm going to do is just shoot the plasmatic right at the smasher. And you can see its health is trickling down. And all we can do is pop another one and boom, it is dead. So the damage on these things are absolutely insane no matter what mission you do. Even if you're a power level one, you can shoot it at one of these and it will be insane. So now you're probably sitting there thinking, well, how do I get this weapon? It was in the llama shop temporarily until the event ended, but now the event's ended. The only way to get this weapon is by coming to your armory, coming to collection book, come to event schematics and come to fort nightmares weapons and as you can see here the plasmatic discharger is shown so the way to get this is obviously by clicking it click research now since i already have this weapon in my collection book i have to reuse a weapon research voucher to take it out but if it was you what you do obviously you'd come to one you click research and it would give you the option to get it out of the book with flux and your weapon designs as well if you're running low on flux make sure to go to the llama shop come to items and buy as much legendary flux as you possibly can so the next weapon that i'm going to be showing you is called the pot shot it is another explosive weapon and it is very helpful towards mist monsters if you get this weapon to 130 and have maxed out rolls as you can see i come to upgrade modify perks these are fully maxed out if you have this this kind of set then you will do basically instant damage so the mob will die pretty much instantly and again you're probably thinking well where do i get the pot shot from well let's come to the collection book head down to the event schematics and come to spy weapons and as you can see here at the bottom we see the pot shot we can click research and we can research the weapon for 100 legendary flux and 1500 weapon designs if you did enjoy this video, please subscribe. I think around 94% of you who watch my videos aren't actually subscribed, so it would mean the world to me. Thank you very much. Take care.